Now, first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. All right, we've got a cold front that continues to come through our region. Because of that, we still have rain mainly off to the east. But I think the big biggie here is, oh man, it's going to get cold tonight and daytime highs tomorrow. Coldest we've seen in quite some time. And we'll talk about that more in just a minute. Storm Tracker, let's get caught up with what's going on. We had some rain right around White River Junction, Lebanon. Looks like most of it just south of you guys there down towards Springfield, right along I-91. Then down toward Brattleboro. It is raining in places like Keene, and this stuff is going to leave. In fact, you can see the movement here. So over the next couple of hours, expect this stuff to move on out, and we'll find very slow clearing from the northwest on down to the south and also the east. Did you notice how early the sun went down? Oh man, tough to take. I mean, it's nice in the morning, I guess, but not so much later in the day. Clouds trying to break up as we look over Burlington Lake Champlain, northern New York, but we've got a ways to go for that to occur. It is 49 degrees in Burlington right now. North wind at 20. The wind is not helping at all right now. The planner, if you're heading out tonight, bundle up. It's going to get cold. Temperatures going down into the 30s. Thinking a low later on, right around the Champlain Valley, like 32 degrees, man. Well, current temperatures above and beyond 47 degrees right now, Plattsburgh. It's already 38 Saranac Lake, 42 degrees in Messina. This is where the colder air is coming from and getting to first. We're going to find the temperatures dropping in all the areas, especially in the green here. It's going to be a big difference over the next few hours. Now, wind speeds, you know, I mentioned this is not helping at all. It's a northwest wind, 20 miles an hour in Burlington, 14 in Plattsburgh, 13 Middlebury. The good news is the wind is not going to last. As a matter of fact, Looking ahead at wind speeds and things are going to be changing for us in a pretty good way. Looking at 8 o'clock tonight, not quite as quickly moving the wind as say right now. Watch what happens. We'll take you right through the overnight and here comes your tomorrow. Look at how light the wind is. It's going to be a colder day. High temperatures only in the low 40s, but this is going to be all right wind wise. I think that's going to make a huge difference. Let's break down tomorrow for you. First thing tomorrow morning, thinking 33 degrees right in the Champlain Valley, mostly sunny. Otherwise, clouds mixing with some sunshine out there. It's going to be a nice looking day, but it's going to be colder. So future cast. Let's look ahead here. 7:30 tonight. No worries at all. We'll take you through the overnight, so the trend is going to be for clearing. First thing tomorrow morning, we see a lot of sunshine. Then it's a mix of sun and clouds. Tomorrow night, no problems. Not exactly warm. It's going to be chilly for sure. And then on Wednesday, temperatures coming up a little bit, and we end up with a decent amount of sunshine on that day. For tonight, expected lows, thinking 32 Burlington, 29 degrees Plattsburgh. Lots of 20s to near 30 degrees on the weather map, but colder Saranac Lake, a little bit closer to 20. It's so a mix of sun and clouds coming up in northern New York tomorrow. 44 Messina, 42 degrees in Plattsburgh, and we'll call it a mix of sun and clouds in Burlington at 42. Chelsea, 44. St. Johnsbury in the 40s. We head on down to the south, and it's a mix of sun and clouds in places like Dover, just 39, 35 Killington, but Spring, uh, Springfield at 46, 48 degrees in Keene. Five day forecast. Let's spread this thing out for you here. 42 to 48 degrees. I think we'll find more sunshine Wednesday as compared to tomorrow. On Thursday, it gets interesting. We've got sunshine, more clouds late in the day. That night, expecting a little snow, maybe some rain mixed in. It's going to be interesting. We're watching that for you. That's that night into Friday. Now, Friday, it's not going to last. Clouds giving way to some sunshine, but note the difference in temperatures. We go from 50 to about 30 degrees. And then we've got a uh, big holiday coming up on Saturday, 35 degrees. The chance for a shower or two Sunday, a little bit shaky at this point, just so you know. And then Monday, it's a mix of sun and clouds and 45.